I'm... I'm back. Playing The Witness. Back from lunch. I'm curious what this thing is about. There's so many different panels and levers and things. I'm actually just going to step away from this thing. Oh, and also... I just remembered something. Oh, I can't drop down. I can do this puzzle now. So I need to first. Hi, hi, hi. Do you need Do you need snuggles? Hi, baby cat. Hello. He's a sweet little baby cat. I love this baby cat. Okay, so, okay. So I need to, I need to do something like, like this will do the separation that I need. So this is, this is great. Oh, I can actually just do it like this. Ah, uh, is that right? And yeah, this should do it, right? Why does that not do it? Oh, 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 because it's on the inside edge. <clears throat> Alright, so I need to... Alright, so what this means is that I need to get a shape, like, so I think that the final shape is like this, right? I'm, I'm, I'm nearly certain that's the last thing I have to do. So then, ooh, actually if I do... No, that certainly won't work. Oh, wait, but if I do this, and then I... No, then they're on the wrong side. All right. Hey, do you know that the stream title is still Dread Steed Lock Round 2? Let's check out if that's true. It is not the title. That is not a true statement. You have lied to me. Kitty, I love you, but you need to go into the box. Okay, so let's see. <clears throat> so I need to have two little tuples going on here. And I think that, like, the most efficient looking shape is something kind of like this. Or something kind of like this. But the problem is then these are on the opposite side of each other. There's another way, but this doesn't necessarily work either. We could also do like this. But then that would not separate this black one. Okay. It could be that my thought on this final shape is incorrect, although that, that seems totally good and shit. I mean, technically it could be this, but I don't know what more this does for us, right? Um, now, what if I actually started on this side? Oh, there's an interesting idea. No, it isn't. It's not fucking interesting in the slightest. Yeah, no, that, that, that would not... I don't think that would ever do anything. Those could connect. Those could connect. Could 
could be like this. And there's those two stacked. Ah. This is not going to do it. Although I think there is merit to doing something kind of like this. If we did that though, that wouldn't separate shit. <clears throat> so those do need to be on opposite sides. I'm talking just like a crazy person right now. This is a tricky puzzle, but I think we can do it. I think we can do it. Starting from here, if we just... Does this help us at all? Really doesn't. I think this needs to be enclosed. Hmm. Okay. I really want to open this thing. These these guys have messed with my mind the most. I think that like other than those, I've been kicking some serious ass. I've been totally slaying. Um, <clears throat> oh, this could be an interesting thing, that some of them are conjoined and other ones are not. Conjoined is such a, it's a bit of a loaded term. So if I do this, that doesn't work. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. What are the rules? Okay, so here's the thing. So first I'll talk about the black and the white. They have to just be on opposite sides of this line. So this, this illustrates the separation. Notice that all the white blocks are on one side and all the black blocks are on another side. Cool. The, these, these little blocks, these little two dots, say that you must contain the two dot and it will also have a, like a two enclosed squares. So for instance, this would satisfy these bottom two dots because they're both contained within one shape and there is the two dots, each corresponding to a pair of squares. So we have to satisfy all of them. I have to both separate the white from the black and ensure that these, that there's enough space to have these like extra square thingies. So for instance, if I started by doing something like this, I've already failed because the black and the white are there together. If I did something like this, I am running out of ways to satisfy this two man. Actually, I could do this, but then that would hurt the other one. So if I do something like this, this could, in theory, help. No, I don't think so. I'm starting to think that there needs to be a big link between these two up here. Oh, wait, is that it? Is that it? One, two, three, four. Shit, almost. Almost, almost, almost. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shit.
going to start just with this look and see see what I feel about this. Hmm. When you say, uh, Aaron Two says, when you contain the yellow dots, do you mean the quantity has to be equal? The quantity and the shape, and the shape. Both these shapes have to be contained within. So, for instance, um, this work. Well, actually, pretty much any collection. There, there are no ways to have two adjacent pair that are not the same. But whatever. Oh, is that it? Why does that not work? Are these not on the same side? Wait, why does that not work? Why does that not work? I, I don't I don't know this. What why why does this not work? Cuz I think that like this is on the opposite side of these white ones. This has these bottom things are contained. Does it actually have to be that they're they're regionally connected like this? I thought that they just had to be on opposite sides of the line. I guess they have to be in a contiguous block. I mean, if they have to be in a contiguous block, this is actually helps tell me what the puzzle is, doesn't it? Because then this it, it, it's something like this but that that can't be it wait 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 wait, wait. so it, it, if these have to be in a contiguous block the only way to do that is to wrap all the way around here so I basically just have to get to here No, I have to get to here, don't I? Like, I have to go to here, and then this satisfies that top. I don't think you can do that. I don't think you can do that. I don't know. I don't know. Shit. Do, do these not count with a white square? Maybe that's what, what, what it is? Wouldn't make terribly much sense. I could have actually sworn that this was the solution. Okay. So
Okay, so there's an assumption I'm making that I'm just going to double check, which is that this top block has to do something like this. And it could conceivably catch here or catch somewhere else, but I feel like this has to be a thing. It doesn't. I don't actually need to loop around this top side, which is an assumption I was making. So, for instance, this is fine. I don't need to go around the top. This border is sufficient. So that means I can tighten this up in this way. Is this... This Tetris piece is always not legitimate. Ah, 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 ah. Okay, I, I realized the assumption I was making. Okay, so this is this is helpful. So let me let me try to trace something here, which is What was the thing that I thought was the solution? It was this. And this is because they're not part of one big contiguous piece. And that's why this doesn't work. Okay. Okay, so if that's not the thing that's working, I can solve this. I just need a pen, not to draw anything with, but just to have something unplugged. Oh, we got a pen. Look, shut up, computer. Be quiet. Hush. Hush you. What 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 are you what are you going on and on about? Hush. Is it this? Alright, can you all still hear me? Doesn't work, doesn't damn work, damn shit, damn. Now, if I did something like this, this does make them all part of a contiguous piece that satisfies the top ones. Dude, fuck. Almost. Ah. What about this way of No, no, that's not even that's not even a thing.
So I, I think going around the back of this thing is bad. Unless, okay. Let me just stare. I think, I think we're gonna be able to do it. I think we're gonna be able to do it. Uh, so there are many ways to solve this white puzzle piece problem. We'll do any number of these. The instant I hook here, we lose. Similarly, if I hook like this, we lose. If I do like this, still go behind. We're okay. Go front of and cut behind. We can go this way, and then we have to cut behind this one. No, no, no. And then we'd actually still. It's these fuckers that are really a pain in the ass. So if we did this, and then did this. Oh, wait, no. Uh, is there any way for these to be... Okay, here's a question. Can these ever have an arrangement where they are on opposite sides? For instance, if I like did this, is that ever going to create a legal combination? I think the answer is no. It will never create a legal combination. So they have to be contiguous. So that means this is acceptable, which we know doesn't work. This is acceptable, which we also know doesn't work. This is acceptable. So I'm going to repeat. So this this is an acceptable pattern. And it hooks behind, which is Oh, I don't think this does it though, right? Cuz all the whites need to be in one contiguous segment. But okay, so looking at these dots, we can either have this and I think that I can definitively say that this does not work because there is no way to ever separate this bottom right white from that bottom left black. What about other things that begin in this way? We know that a Tetris piece is not a legal combination. This forces us to do something like this, which we know is not a legal, or it doesn't satisfy the contiguity. So I'll actually claim that, let's see, so if this doesn't work, this is also another alternative. But then I have to come down here, and once again, this does What? Why does that work? What? What? So, I think that here, here is the misunderstanding that I had, which is that this and this, the all these whites, had to be on the same side. When in fact, all I really had to do was just separate them so that within a segment there's none of the same two colors. How does that work with the top two yellows? Here's two, here's two, like that. Yeah, so, so... The other solution that I was trying that I was surprised didn't work think was this
and yet this one does work. Why? I have no explanation as to why that doesn't work. I have no idea as to why that doesn't work. I got it. 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 I see it. I have it. I understand. I understand. Here's the difference. Here's the difference. Here's the difference. I fucking understand it. Fucking listen to me. Here's the explanation. These are deliberately arranged horizontal, and if they are deliberately arranged horizontal, you must ensure that they are too deliberately arranged horizontal. However, if we look at the previous version that I was basing my understanding off, if we were looking at the previous version that I was basing my understanding off, if it is tilted diagonal, this means if it is tilted diagonal that it can be in any formation. This can be in any formation. And these ones that are tilted diagonally, see how I have one, two, three here? It can be this way, it can be one, two, three, it can be this way. That is the difference. Okay, fucking sick. Yeah, fucking testosterone flooding my body. What in the fuck is this shit? So I think this will just work. I still don't understand what these shapes mean, but... There we go. Fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah, dude. Oh shit, dude. Fuck yeah, man. I got this shit. This is my game, man. Now, if you want to know what this this shape means, I have no fucking clue. You know what? I'm 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 gonna. I just don't want to be in this area anymore. I'm just gonna get the fuck out of here. No, I should be responsible. I should clear it up. Oh, God. Let's go up. I think that is the starting one for sure. Not learned that one yet. I don't know. Now I'm gonna give it a shot. Here's the only puzzle that's up here. I don't know what that symbol means. I don't know what that symbol means. You know, I'm done with this area. I don't give a shit about this area anymore. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Oh, here's the windmill that I ascended behind previously. Cool. Nice. Down the hatch. Oh, fucking cool. Oh, this is so cool. I also have to be on the lookout for more of those USB chat things.
I remember you. Well, that's no better a solution than any of the others, is it? So, in the end, have we learned anything from this look at why the world turned out the way it did that's of any use to us in our future? Something, I think. That the key to why things change is the key to everything. How easy is it for knowledge to spread? And that in the past, the people who made change happen were the people who had that knowledge, whether they were craftsmen or kings. Today, the people who make things change, the people who have that knowledge, are the scientists and the technologists who are the true driving force of humanity. And before you say, what about the Beethovens and the Michelangelos, let me suggest something with which you may disagree violently. That at best, the products of human emotion, art, philosophy, politics, music, literature, are interpretations of the world that tell you more about the guy who's talking than about the world he's talking about. Second-hand views of the world made third-hand by your interpretation of them. Things like that, as opposed to this. Know what it is? It's a bunch of amino acids. The stuff that goes to build up a, a worm or a geranium or you. Me. This stuff's easier to take, isn't it? Understandable. Got people in it. This scientific knowledge is hard to take because it removes the reassuring crutches of opinion, ideology, and leaves only what is demonstrably true about the world. And the reason why so many people may be thinking about throwing away those crutches is because, thanks to science and technology, they have begun to know that they don't know so much and that if they are to have more say in what happens to their lives, more freedom to develop their abilities to the full, they have to be helped towards that knowledge that they know exists and that they don't possess. And by help towards that knowledge, I don't mean give everybody a computer and say help yourself where would you even start no i mean trying to find ways to translate the knowledge to teach us to ask the right questions see we're on the edge of a revolution in communications technology that is going to make that more possible than ever before or if that's not done to cause an explosion of knowledge that will leave those of us who don't have access to it as powerless as if we were deaf, dumb, and blind. And I don't think most people want that. So what do we do about it? I don't know. But maybe a good start would be to recognize within yourself the ability to understand anything, because that ability is there, as long as it's explained clearly enough. And then go and ask for explanations. And if you're thinking right now, what do I ask for? Ask yourself if there's anything in your life that you want changed. That's where it starts. What in the fuck? Very pleased I remember this little this little thing. Oh. Well, oh. that's no better a solution than any of the others, is it? So, in the end... So, if I find these notes all over the place... And what do these fucking shapes mean? Okay. Uh, I haven't learned enough. The only way 
way to learn is to try. I have another place I want to explore. Oh, that's a great hint. And if there were Dark Souls, you'd just have to fall down it. Got it. Ah! Ah, 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 that's where it opens to. Great. Sick. Huh. Where does the cord go? Up and around and down and over. And then over to here. Now why would this not let me do it? Interesting. Don't know enough. Going to continue to venture forth and acquire more knowledge. Knowledge. Here, yeah, knowledge, knowledge, knowledge. Oh, yeah. Sit up a little bit, man. There's that shape again. <clears throat> Let me just check for audio devices. Okay. I'm ready to go find some puzzles and crush them. Puzzle crushing. How does witness compare to something like Mr. Talos Principle? Oh my god, if you like those, you gotta get this game. In fact, all of you should just go buy this game right now. Damn. Colors are so beautiful. Alright, sick, tight, sick, dope, good, great, excellent, very well. Surprise says, I don't feel like this is a 40 euro game. It has literally one mechanic. What do you mean? where I am. I, I got disoriented for a moment. Did you praise the sun today? No, but I hope to later tonight. Surprise says it's just walking around solving puzzles and they all get solved the same way. Dude, they don't though. They don't. How long have you been watching? I mean, this is like saying, dude, why play World of Warcraft? It's just one mechanic. Get more powerful. That's the entire game. Don't play Counter Strike. It's just one mechanic. Shoot. Dude, Surprise, you, you, oh my gosh, totally get this game, Surprise. Oh, it will let me do it. Sick, I have long range hands. <sighs> I 
feel like there's something to be told in this room. Ah. So one powers this one, that one powers that one, that one powers this one. But what turns you on? Oh. Out here somewhere. Got it. that work? How does that work? Well, I shall journey across. Damn. This is beautiful. All right, so I want to go there, and I want to go there. But first, I'm going to go here. Okay. So there's little gates lurking around. Is that my path? Is that my path to arrive here? Seems that these gates would prevent me from arriving to my desired destination. But I'm too good. Really? Okay, so this area represents corresponds to this puzzle so there are paths that I can't take so let's just repeat to ourselves how to get through here All right so I'm gonna go left and then I'm going to keep going until I hit this four square I'm gonna turn till I get just underneath it and there it is I'm gonna go left until I get just around this four square and then I go just underneath it easy Easy, easy, lemon Fabrizi. Sitting on a telephone, easy. So I guess I can just go anywhere here. Is it a path with no grass? Probably. So this is a dead end. So I start, I go right, and then I turn. Bringing me almost all the way there. And I arrive. It's, it's that or the other one. There we go. Now I must listen. I must listen. Boom. By the way, I didn't I didn't actually say what I was doing there. I was listening for the and that's a bad place. That's a bad place to walk. What what am I powering anyways? I just I'm just here to, I'm just here to solve puzzles. Hope is just whatever way I want. Oh, does this not actually correspond? I have to find a path through 
this garden that corresponds to an available path through this garden. I see. So they're both different, but I have to find the one that matches, right? So I go in here. I can immediately come left like this. I can immediately go forward. Well, I have to go left. I go up. No. Wow. Forward, and then we go this way. Easy. Ah, oh, it's satisfying. So much mystery. Were these all the power to this door? Great, 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 great. Oh, you didn't get the last one? Okay, so, so. So in all the ones that we've done so far, this maze matched the physical maze, and there was some constraint, like there were fences, or there was subtle grass, and then it was audio. In this one, this doesn't match this maze in the slightest. For instance, notice that this path indicates that if I went through the door, there would be an open path here, but there isn't. So I theorized that I had to find a path that went through the physical maze, that could also get me through this maze. So I found one that got through both of them. Turned out that theory was correct. Boom! Slaying puzzles. Like it's nobody's business. That's probably a rendering bug. You conjectured, not theorized. No, I think I used theorized correctly. No, Miriam Webster, just give me the fucking thing to look up. Theorize. To think of or suggest ideas about what is possibly true or real. Great. Or to form a theory about. I think I used it correctly. Depends on the which field's definition you're looking for. In common everyday English, I use theorize correctly. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Ah, what is the entire path that you took through all of these things? Is that is that what it's asking me? So first, I went over, back through the quarter, up and around. At the second one, I think I just know the paths, so this is, it's just, so I started here, I entered, I looped, I came up here, and so it was this way. This 
The second one I'm not as sure about. So there was... No, 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 something, something's not lining up here. Why does that second one not line up? Is there, did I miss something up in this top corner? Because there's that. Huh, I think this is actually wrong. Yeah, see, see, here's what I'm looking at. Let me use my mouse. Go, go to fucking here, dude. See how there's this peg, and there's this peg? And then look in the distance, and there's only one peg. You see, up right here, I only see one peg. Nonetheless, I think I, I have a solution. And then this looped around like this. And then here, pull down like this, and then I entered this garden, which then first went this way, and then I looped around like this, and then for this one... BOOM! Holy shit, that was so fucking sick! Yeah! Shine that light! I, I earned that! Did I not earn that? Did I not earn that shit? Holy shit. We need to take a break after that one. Oh my god. Sick. Fucking yes. Oh my god. Get fucked, Google Maps. I'll find my own fucking way there. <laughs> mm. This little light of mine. <laughs> Love it, new sunshine. I'm gonna let it shine. Come on. Mmm, fuck yeah, dude. Holy shit, let me take a breath and a mint. I hope you all witnessed me. longer break we might call it three or four minutes but I shall return mm. this little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine <laughs> 